hello everybody and welcome back to another episode how is everybody doing <laughs> man i'm doing so good we just reached 20k subs and i couldn't be happier uh, i think it, we reached it after i recorded the last clip so i really didn't even mention it even that, that we were close so i didn't want to jinx it or anything uh but we reached 20k and i couldn't do it without you guys and your support and all the likes and love you give me on every video the support is just through the roof and I, i'm so happy right now we, we, we made it we've been we've been going for a while now i don't know how long have you been doing youtube I don't know, maybe four, four years or something. Uh, I don't know, man, and, and it just feels so good uh, to get to that that milestone, but we're not done yet. Let's keep this going, <laughs> but thank you again so much for all your support, guys. I really do appreciate it. You guys are the best. Love your faces, uh, but man, you know what? Last episode, we started expanding on our new area. It's looking so, so good. I asked you guys after we did that castle gate, what do you want to see next? Do you want to continue with that human side? We're doing that medieval city. Uh, wall it off maybe start the little process of laying down all the spots and 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 you guys were like yes i also shut your mouth don't i don't even want to hear anymore uh but i also asked if you wanted me um to, to bounce back to uh, the the witch's side where we're going to work on a witch's kingdom and also we have a little um uh, an elf elvish not elvis elvish side also if you want to jump to that one and maybe do little concept builds of what it would look like on the witch's side or on the on the elf side we even have a little dwarven kingdom we can get on to but a lot of people you know really want me to stick with the, the the regular kingdom the human side the medieval one build it up have a little bit of, a, of an idea before you bounce to the next side and that's a good idea we can go maybe uh, the next five episodes or so let's see um work on uh the, the layout of the medieval human side and then we could jump to either or uh, uh, and, and see how we can build up this world and we got a couple <laughs> projects already lined up but before we even get into it I, I came back to serenity fields for two things number one come with me i updated the map i just wanted to see what it would look like with that little added piece and check that out look how cool right there on the bottom end bottom right you see right here uh they got the little uh the little path and then we got the bridge hold on up to fine go there it is. Look how cool. We got the bridge right there. We got the two lovelies right here, the little, two little towers right now. And then, you know what? We also, this is this is what I'm planning on doing today. We're doing the wall. We're not going to do the whole wall because this wall go all the way like this. I'm not going to make a huge wall. But I want to go ahead and give uh, uh, some kind of an idea of how we're going to work out this wall. I want to do maybe some terraforming here on this grassy side right here. Uh, I want to make it a very organic wall, okay? It's going to go probably like this direction. We're going to curve it, and it's going to come back around like this. And then on this side, we're also going to go straight down and curve it the other way. Uh, and if you do notice, before we had a little bit of a landmass that was popping out right here. I got rid of it. I got rid of it because it does, I didn't like the way it was going to be there uh, defensible. It's not going to be, it, it's too much in the open. If I would have done it, it, the wall would have been so weird. It was too skinny. So I guess got rid of that and it looks a lot better with this curve right here. Just a little uh, pop out that was like right there. I didn't like it. It was ugly. Uh, so I got rid of that. Uh, but we're going to work on that wall today. But before we even do that, you know what? I haven't checked uh, from the last time we were over here. We did some AFK fish and there was a bunch of uh, nice loot some valuables uh down there in the afk fish farm i never checked it i want to see what kind of books we have there uh, i want to see what kind of loot we got from that last time so let's let's co come with me uh and we're gonna check this out also another thing we do have two new doggies they're over there guarding the wall a baby is one of them uh and, and cappy is the other one my two real life uh, baby boys and they're the best we're gonna make houses for them too so right now we only got bubbles's house right now they can share it for now but i think we need to add two more we might even make a little doggy village <laughs> i don't know if that would be cool um because maybe this could be shared by all three but maybe we can have like a nice little uh, uh like a little a little uh, a little section just for them just three separate ones i don't think it could fit two more houses in this space the way it's packed up or maybe back here oh no we could do it we could do it right here on top of this little mountain. We could add two more houses right here. Get rid of this tree. Put a little house maybe back here on this end and another house right here. Oh, we could definitely do that. Oh, man, that'd be cool, a cool little project. You know what? I might even do it as a stream. I might even do that as a stream. So follow me on Twitch if you guys want to see some stream in action. I think I might even stream today. I might. I might. We'll see. Uh, but let's check out what we had here. I'm really curious what we, what kind of loot we had. I never really checked it. All right. Let's, so let's see. I'm just going to really look for books. I'm really curious about the books. This is all the books we have right now which is not much let's see what we got all right and we got all our stuff ready to go for building that wall i'm so ready uh so let's see books sharpness three eh eh looting two eh we can make that into looting three sharpness three nah 
Ah, these are boring. Sweeping air. Oh, sweeping air. Impaling. Oh, if this is there, we go. That's a worker book right there. Sharpness. There we go. Can make a better, a be, not a better sword. My sword is the best. We could just make another sword. Uh, this was okay. So it has a lot of stuff in it. Uh, let's just start piling this on. I'll separate them later. Oh, that's a common question of the day. Don't look at that. that well, I'll show you at the end of the <laughs> at the end of the episode who got that one. Aquafinity. Oh, very nice. Oh man, you know what? We need to go hunting for a um, a trident, man. I really want to try it. We got all the books necessary to make the most OP tridents in the history of tridents. So I think we got to go ahead and try to do that soon. Oh, fortune three. If this see that is my kind of book right there oh i like this let's put these away too let's put this away and why is my hat not on my head oh we already oh, the comment of the day don't you dare sneak in there uh let's put that in here <laughs> let's put my helmet on too i don't want to get blown up by something uh protection that is aquafinity eh. fire protection fire aspect flame silk touch yes that is my book right there i do love me some silk touch and a break we can combine those uh, efficiency four. There we go. We could do an efficiency five book if anything. Uh, oh, I'll come back here and, and separate the good ones. Okay, don't even worry about it. Uh, what do we have here? Oh, so many books. Fire protection. Ooh, I like this one. That's a lot of junk in it. <laughs> this is a good one. Knockback, not too good. Bane of Arthropods, get out of here. Impaling, Frostwalker, Riptide, Silk Touch again. You know what? I want to make some a um. Uh, some booty, some new air sausage Jordans with uh, with the the um, what's it called? The Frost Walker. That would be so much fun. I would love to walk around and make ice. Uh, so so far these are like whatever. I don't even like one. What, what's happening over here? This, some of these are all right, but uh, the silk touches, the unbreakings, those are the ones that just make me feel good. And the mendings about time, mending and efficiency four. Now that is what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about right there. Uh, man, another mending gas. Yeah, see, that's what I was looking for the most. But you know what? I'll take my frost walkers. I'll take my efficiency, my own breakings. That's fine with me. I think that's it. Those are all my good books. All right, we're good. So we did find some lovelies in here. I can't wait to just make stuff with them. And then I'm gonna have to. Um, I'll do this off cam. This is a lot of junk. I'm gonna have to go ahead and just put stuff in their spots. And you look at all these nautilus shells. We definitely gotta make a use for them. Oh. Let me take some of those lily pads. We need those to do a little, uh, let me take all of them. No, let me leave some so I can remember this is where I put them. Uh, <laughs> so I'm going to take some of these to do some terraforming. But you know what? Give me a second, guys. Let me get all of the way back to our spot. Go by the wall and do some stuff over there. We're going to make some pretty stuff. You're going to, you watch. Oh, it's nighttime. Um, run. Oh, man. This is just too pretty. <laughs> I love this gatehouse. And you guys did too, man. Thank you so much for all the kind words for uh, for this gatehouse, man. We did it. We did a really good job. I kind of like I kind of like it. I kind of like it. And look who it is right here. Bubbles, Cappy, baby. What's going on? Protectors of the realm hanging out here doing their thing. <laughs> we got to we gotta definitely make some houses for them. But thank you guys for being here. Thank you. You know, high fives to everybody. Uh, now, let's work on this wall. So what I'm thinking about doing is... Connecting uh, these corners right here uh, to to the wall. I'm thinking just to make it a one wide for now because it's gonna be a lot of work to do, make it ultra detailed. But we can. Uh, I, I, at first, I really was thinking about doing almost like a five wide with a three wide walkway. But if I had to do that with every piece of this wall going around here, it's gonna be the biggest project in the history of projects, and you guys will get bored uh, watching all that. So I'm thinking about doing just a. Just a three by three, right? We have your main wall section, your maybe one wide walkway, and uh, another extra bit for the other side of the wall. The most of the details are gonna be on the outer part of the wall because we're gonna make it like this. We're gonna make like rocky cliff faces, uh, very organic looking. Uh, certain spots are not gonna have all the most organicness like this. Um, this would just be on certain spots maybe. Uh, and then we'll have certain spots also that are a little more defensible with a little more uh, a, a, a little more bulk to them. Uh, but uh, the majority is gonna be like this. It's gonna look pretty cool. Uh, and I'm going with a similar palette. I, I'm the towers uh we do have these little andesite bits on the wall i'm not gonna do those little andesite bits the way i'm gonna probably do it do a dirty bottom side with like andesite cobble mossy stuff like that on the bottom on um, the top is gonna be mostly cobble with um with, with splashes of stone but it's gonna be mostly a cobble base uh with a lot of stone on the top but the dirty bottom like that and we're gonna do something like this come with me actually on this side check this out so right over here 
uh, we did some a little test right here. So some of these are gonna have like spiky bottoms like this with the uh, spiky bottom. This sounds weird. Uh, no, it's gonna have like little spiky bottoms like this. Uh, so it's gonna be uh, defensible, almost like a, a barbed wire fence is in modern day times. You know, you don't want to climb that because you might get stuck with something. So this is gonna be around the lake side, the lake, the, the riverside. The lake is over there, um, and then we'll, we'll keep that theme going around. So it's gonna be hard to scale over. Uh, so we're gonna do stuff like that. But a lot of these rocky, broken spots, uh, and then this texture variation is gonna happen all throughout uh, the bottom of the walls going around. Uh, but let me first start with uh, kind of like the outline. Uh, so let's go with cobble, just cobble, and see how we're gonna do this. So I'm gonna go right from here. Let's actually take it right from in here. I'm gonna go make it pretty organic. So it's gonna go just curve around, come this way, and then we're gonna go that way. On the other side, we'll work it out too. So let's see, what if I just go, there's no no method to this. I'm just gonna see how it will look cool curving around this end. So we did a four here, let's do like a three. Let's do another three, four. Then let's start curving it more towards the river side. Actually, we should actually, hmm, should we push it more out right off the bat? I think we should push it more out right off the bat uh, because it's already too much uh, in land and it's going to take up too much space on the inside. So let's curve it out a little more. Uh, so let's do, I think three is fine. Let's take it out one, two, I think right here. Uh, let's see. Let's take this out one, two, three. Let's start going more this way. Let's do a two. Let's do a three here. Let's take this out. Uh, let's see, right here, let's go with a two, one, two, one, two. I think we're still too much in the land though. Hmm. I, I just don't wanna do a sharp like diagonal right off the bat. Hmm. Let me let me play around with it. So hold on, let, let me come up with an outline. <laughs> let me come up with a good outline and then we'll start doing some texture variation and some uh, some walling up. All right, give me a second, hold on. Let me, let me think this through. All right, we were able to work it out. So I actually went with a, I came down this way and then I just went with a little bit of a diagonal and then I just cut straight down this direction. And that actually worked out really good. We can still uh, do a lot of terraforming, a lot of good stuff on this side. And then it looks good, it looks good. I think it's a height of an average of six to seven, depending on the uh, elevation change. So it looks good, it looks good for now. All cobble, kind of boring, but it, it looks good as far as the uh, the outline. Uh, so we did go all the way down this way. Let's see if we could do some parkour right here, you know, some tightrope action. Look at this, perfection. Uh, I wanted to add a little tower to this corner, a small one, really good, uh, defensible little tower. And then this uh, kind of stopped right there because um, I also went down that direction and I have no more cobblestone. I think we're good, we're cobblestone. We need to go on a, on a long mining, uh, maybe a quarry build expedition to try to get a bunch of uh, more resources. But man, this is looking really good. Now coming this way, let me show you the other direction too. Kind of stop right at this end right here. Uh, and we also have a tower right here in this little corner. And this kept all the way around and curved right to this end. Uh, I gotta do some terraforming here. So we'll probably just, uh, just go straight up against this wall. So lift this up a little bit. I might lower this part a little so we can have a little more space. But yeah, looking pretty good. Another little tower here. Same dimensions as the other one. Uh, I might change the style of the towers. Have like a bunch of different style towers uh, going in, in um, different directions. And we might even add a couple more little bits of um, a tower, right? Okay, that's right. <laughs> but it's looking really good. The only thing now we gotta do is a lot of texture variation changes. So it looks a little better. Come up with a nice little outline uh, on the bottom with some nice rough rocks around the edges. But as far as the tops here, um, I was thinking about connecting it to this way here and then maybe you have a walkway going in. But I, I don't know, I kinda like the way that's all separate. But I might have like little ways up right here. Uh, maybe like little platforms to get up and out up to the tippy top. So we'll work on that too. But on the top of these, this is what I'm thinking. Just to come in with some random stones uh, and change it up a bit. But let's see, maybe little arrow slit section, stuff like that. Uh, so I'm thinking about just coming in right about, let's see, we can actually start on this corner. Let me show you what I got in mind and then we'll we'll keep going. Uh, so something like this, have something kind of like moving out like like so. Maybe some of these would actually be a little bit taller. Uh, and I'm thinking on the top parts, we can actually uh, play around and put more brick on the tops, like right around these edges have more brick, right? And then have almost like the top layer be more brick. So we can knock stuff down to do our texture change, texture variation, but have uh, a lot of brick like coming around like so on the top part edges and kind of like, see it comes down like that. 
Oh, I like that. That looks really, really cool. Uh, but do we have any? Yes, let me switch some of these up too. I'll put the andesite later on. Uh, some of these. Here we go. So, uh, more brick on the top. So, let's see. What if we do, uh, instead of this, let's do this and this. Uh, let's do a couple that go kind of up like so. And then come in, in like this. Do maybe like a little, kind of like an arrow slit style kind of thing like this and then this would go somewhat like here like let me show you something like that in between so you have this little arrow slit style or let me see something like that like you have like a walkway but then you have this little gaps that you can shoot arrows through uh and i'm gonna pepper those in around uh some of these uh since they're all diagonal look a little weirder than others but you know we can still work it out stuff like this maybe knocks out uh, knock down a little bit of that and then come back in here and do something like so bring in a couple of these slabs right here uh maybe even we can still bring in some of the cobble that's fine stuff like this well we'll change it up a bit let me see let me look from down here yeah like that some stuff like this coming up uh we can even have other ones go a little bit higher on certain corners maybe even bring in a little more of that cobble in there there we go uh, turn this sideways and this is gonna be a lot of random placements of stuff but it's gonna look pretty cool pretty defensible so uh, let me work on this right now let me go all the way down I don't think I'm gonna do that side I think that's just a template but I think I'm just gonna do this all the way around do some texture variation and we'll see where we can go from there oh man this is looking so cool I love it there we go looky looky at this wall <laughs> so uh, i went ahead and i did one little tower this is the most basic tower i just wanted to use this one as our starting point over there i'm going to do a different kind of tower i will do, do that together right now but check this out there we go the texture variation the added detail around the wall going all the way around a little bit of a uh, of a flowery area over there really cool i added a bunch of details also the same ones we did over here i just continued it on this wall added some vines over here on this end i want to add a couple more vines here but i have to go to the vine farm and it's kind of far now uh but i love this uh it's really broken up we have some sections here with like the wall breaking up so we put some walls actually in there uh some stairs upside down we got some arrow slit windows on both sides and this is looking so 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 good i love this let's come over here on this end and it's looking so nice but let, hold on let me get to the tippity top and i'll show you what's up on the other side all right now we're on the other end and check this out i wanted to do brick as being our main walkway and look how cool that looks with the pop of that brick color going all the way around this goes to this little tower we have a little uh ladder to go up ladder to go over there uh and then it comes down and around and we have a little outline it's a little walkway over here uh and everything looks pretty cool look at this we have little arrow slits right here with defensible spots right here you can throw arrows and th throw whatever you want throw a boulder i don't know if you're strong enough uh and then this like, little arrow slits right there with the the witches come man pa 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 i'm gonna slap them uh and then this goes to this tower and i really want to do a different kind of tower here uh, and just a little stair to go up to the back and look how cool this is so nice we got to terraform a lot over here uh make it look a little better a little more lived in uh but yeah it's looking really really cool look at that i love it uh this tower here i want to make it more out of wood uh so come here let's, let's go together i'll show you a little bit of how we're going to do this uh let's just do a little tiny little tower so we expanded this this actually went out a little bit uh right here oh and check this out right here look we have a, like a little patch right there oh that looks so good i love that a little a little gardeny patch even though whatever it's not defensible it's just for, for looks leave it alone uh but uh over here i really want to play around with um a different style of tower so i want to go with wood so like one two three four just going like this uh on every one of these wow every one of these corners right here uh, just by four on all the ends and in the middle i'm just gonna go ahead with some spruce uh and then we'll go with like a spruce top so it's gonna look pretty cool uh let's see if we can just do this real fast this is super easy i'll come back in here and put some windows and stuff like that but for now let's just do it just like so bam bam bam, bam. so easy right there look at this this is a simple little tower uh but man i've been having so much fun so much inspiration uh with this build right now adding these walls up uh but man we're gonna have to go ahead and expand this uh, for quite a way around. I don't know how big we're going to make it, but this thing is going to go, let's see, right here. We're going to probably curve it around and it's going to do some kind of a circle to get to this. We're not going to do this whole area. It's not going to be humongous, but this is probably going to be walled off 
right around here and come back to that. And I really want to work a, ca a castle out in this area too. So I'm thinking right on the back end, like right back here, uh, we can make that castle probably at the end of that uh, big wall right there. I don't know. <laughs> That'll be pretty cool. But that's coming later on. Uh, so for now, let's do this. I'm going to come with, with just with spruce. And then we're just going to go with slabs for now, going all the way around like so. Just slabs going like this. Uh, and then I'm going to work on a little peekity peek. Oh, hello. This broke. Hold on. There we go. So this goes all the way around. Really simple. And I'm thinking about just going straight up right here. Uh, and then right around here, maybe put a little pop in right there of a, of a log. Oh, hold on. Not this one. This one's going to be a slab, I think. So slab here and here. Uh, probably going to do stairs here and here. Probably a stair here and there. Come in back with the slab action. Bum bum. There we go. Bum bum. Right here in all the ex little exposed pieces right there. A vlog. Put that in the middle. And let's see if this comes out okay. I got an idea. Uh, it's going to be a pretty nice little peek to this thing. So let's see if we can make it, uh, make it work. So something like so. And then right here, I'm going to come back in uh, with, uh, let's see, let's put a full block on all of these. Full block right there. Full block right there. Then I'm going to come behind this just like so. Ah, oh, man, come on, hold on. Do I have enough? I should have enough. Uh, so then we're going to come back here like so. Uh, swing it around. This is going to go here. This is going to go there. Uh, swing this around like this. And uh, let's see if we can come up with a really cool peak over here. I don't want to make it too, too tall, but not actually not too small either. Uh, so something like so. Back here, we might have to raise this up. Let's see, raise it up here, raise that up right there, raise that up here. Uh, these we don't need anymore. I'm probably going to go knock these down and get it in a second. Hold on. Don't despawn, please, Wood. I need you. Um, and then uh, right here, let's go with a stair, a stair, and a stair. So we got a stair, a stair, and a stair. But hello, you broke stair. You broke it. Uh, so right there. And then another one this direction. And oh, hello. There we go. And one more little stair, stair, and stair trick. There we go. Uh, right here, I'm thinking about just coming straight up with it right there. And then come in with another stair pattern, just like so. Let's see if this comes out okay. Uh, I might want to come back here and tweak it a little bit with a, uh, just breaking it up, but I think. Uh, this might just do it. Ugh, come on, parkour sauces. Let's go. Oh, baby. So good at this game. Sometimes. Well, all the time. It's fine. <laughs> so let's go like this. Uh, just going all the way around like so. These go in the middles. Here we can go with a slab, 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 slab. And here we can go with a stair, 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 stair. And let's go like this. And then up top, we can go with a wall and two fence posts. And let's see, let's jump down. We're gonna be fine. Ow, something like that. Oh, baby, yes, I love it. I love that, that looks so good. Let me jump down to this end. Oh yeah, I like that a lot. I like that a lot, let me go around here. Oh yes, look at that, that is awesome. <laughs> All right, you know what? We're almost done with it. Uh, let me go ahead. I'm going to put some windows on there. Let me uh, get a couple little details in here, and I'll be right back. And that'll be it. We got our lovely wall, um, our, our, our small wall for now. <laughs> but at least we got a template for the future of all these walls. All right, give me a second. Look at this tower, though. Oh, baby, and we are done. The place is looking amazing. I'm in love. This is really a cool wall. I'm happy. I'm so, so happy how it came out. It's kind of exactly how I pictured it in my mind. And then plop, we plopped it down, and it, it came out really, really cool. And I love all the details, but now the only problem is to redo this style all the way around. We still haven't done that one yet, but... Uh, that'll be a long uh, project, but for now, you know what? I'm super happy. I did modify the tower just a tad bit, just so it could be a little more defensible. Because I noticed if we put a, a window there, uh, it's gonna be hard to shoot stuff. Uh, a bunch of witches trying to climb the walls. We need uh, it to be more of a watchtower instead of just a regular tower tower. So, optifine, do your job.
There we go. Uh, so we have these cool little openings right there with the trap doors looking all awesome. It came out really good. I'm, I'm very, very happy, very pleased. I might have found a little bit of that tower just to give it a little bit more of a, of a peak, uh, uh, but not, nothing too crazy. The only thing we just did is just modify just a tad, even just add a little bit of a border of dark oak, if you notice right around, uh, just so it could stand out a little more. That, that And it came out a, a lot better. Oh man, but I love it. This place is looking so good. Uh, but thank you so much everybody for watching. Let me go ahead and read the comment of the day from the last episode and you guys had a lot of these comments because remember uh the question of the day last time i even put a poll up i was asking what do you guys want me to go to do, what do you want me to do next continue with the medieval human side of town go to the witch's side go to the elf side and it was overwhelmingly stay here and this is the one that really drew me in let me let me let me bring in it pop right here so saints productions was like you should explore more of the human side for a couple of episodes and then uh get a solid idea of the city and the kingdom down and then jump to the next one and that's the perfect idea let's get uh some stuff rolling in here let's get a little bit of the outline we got the wall already but man guess what we have so many possibilities to build inside these walls we got uh we could do town halls we could do that library of commons that we kept saying we were gonna do uh we uh townhouses we could do uh, uh actual little restaurants pubs inns oh man it, it, it's so many endless possibilities but let me know down below what should we build as far as our first build inside the first building inside besides the walls what is the first building that we should do uh coming up so we got the walls down i think we should do a building in here very very soon maybe even the next one so let me know down below what is the next building that we should build inside these walls right here <laughs> but thank you so much for watching everybody i'm out of here for now thank you again for all the support for all oh, man all you 20k plus uh, uh lovelies in the in 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 the comment section just go down below and, and you know what high fives to everybody ow that hurt me and i'm sorry for ear ear warning okay well, i'm leaving i'm gonna get out of here we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna get to build it very very soon thank you again so much for watching all right goodbye everybody take some mutton we got so many